hard to choose a few because it's easy to remember, you know, the wins, the good moments, the highs. But even the lows they were great too in a different um, sense of connection, of camaraderie, of uh, doing it together, um, not pointing at anybody. Just you know, um, we win it together, we lose it together. So even the the bad moments, the tough ones, um, I, I'm proud of them too. Uh, they those moments get you better, smarter. Um, make you grow. So it's hard to choose one moment. I, I think the whole trip uh, is, is is incredible and um, and it's being incredible. The play last night where you went through David West's legs with the dribble. Is mm -hmm. there any part of that that is conscious, a conscious decision, or is it all just instinct? Uh, I mean, when you. S See the position in which he was and the way he was guarding the pick and roll. I kind of, uh, when I started and I saw him in that position, I, I went for it. Um, it's not that I planned it the whole day or. <laughs> uh, it's just the, when I saw him uh, getting ready for that head or shift, I, that's when I decided. Mother Danny Green says uh, you guys got him right where you want him. <laughs> Yeah, we've been planning all this. We want to make something really big, and you know, coming back from a 3 0 would make it. So, yeah, exactly where we wanted them. <laughs> Mike Brown and, and the analysts last night all said, you know, it's clear that you can be playing in your 40s. Is this changing thinking? No, I'm the same guy that was struggling against Memphis and that you were all concerned. <laughs> same exact guy, sometimes, you know, having good games, sometimes bad ones and sometimes making shots and sometimes not um, same guy and and I always said it uh, winning the championship or not winning it uh, scoring 20 the last game or second to last or whatever uh, or zero is not gonna change who I am or the decision I make I can't you know throw nine months to the trash and just you know feel or respond to the way I felt the last game it's not about that. It's a uh, more, uh, you know, thought, well thought uh, decision, and and I'll let it sink as I've been doing it lately, uh, and see how it goes. The fact that you made it through this whole season pretty much healthy and and no really major injuries is that that that's important to you? Yeah, yeah, right. for sure, it's huge. Um, the the times in which I had to. You know, be rehabbing the whole time and have having multiple issues is the the moments where I thought that I was better to just stay at home. But um, the last three seasons have been great, except minor uh, <laughs> incidents. Um, but um, I I had great seasons. And I'm I'm very happy with the way they went. Um, again, I I've been enjoying the ride as I wanted to. Uh, so I'm in a good spot. When you said you're going to let it sink in, what's that process going to be? Like? Are we are we having the the retirement <laughs> conference? Are, are you are you guys <laughs> wanting me to say something here? Uh, I don't know. I don't know what, what I'm going to do, say, or I just go game by game. Um, we'll see if tomorrow is the last one of the season. We'll hope that it's not, and that we have a few more. Um, and once you know it's over. Then I'll start thinking about what the future brings. Have you ever seen anything like this, though, that, that you guys have been through? I mean, it's just bad luck mm -hmm. losing the guys that you've that you lost throughout this because the postseason started with a lot of optimism. Yeah, we, we, we've seen it on on opponents. Uh, never happened to us. Um, well, we there was one year that I didn't play uh, the, the playoff games, but we, we've seen it against, and sometimes it happens. Sometimes it's, you know, you catch a tough break and you lose a couple of key players and you gotta keep fighting. And sometimes it feels like even unfair because, you know, you do great for most of the season. You fought to get to this spot and then you lose, well, the key player, two key players that you've been relying on for so long. So it, it makes it even tougher, good, te good test in some way to see your personality or what you're made of and we are here fighting uh, 
sometimes again it looks like unfair because you know we're playing against a, a great team that it was going to be hard regardless of who was on the court and who's not. Um, but uh, again, as we've said it many times, if this is the worst thing that ever happens to us, we are in a very good spot. I mean, with so many people saying nice things about you and reflecting on your career, I mean, is, is that weird? Like you're like you're going away someplace? Or how, how, how I'm feeling that weirdness now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you, I didn't feel any weirdness yesterday or the days before because I I don't know when what's being said. Again, I I don't follow but uh this is getting a little weird <laughs> <laughs> it truly is